Okay, so when you first walk into my craft room, this is what you see. This is how I store all my craft supplies in these drawers. So if I take you around here, the first thing actually is this cupboard here, um, where I keep some handmade jewellery stands, which has all my handmade jewellery on it. See you there? And then next up, this is my storage cupboard. So in this first one here, this is just all stuff that I'm collecting for my upcoming wedding. So mostly the stuff in here is flowers. I've got all these from Quality Save. They're just £1.50 a bunch, which I think is a real bargain. So I've got these in this dark pink, light pink, a lilac -y purple and um, like a cream colour. And the next one is the roses. Again, these are from Quality Save. They're one pound fifty a bunch. I've got them in this pink colour, and then again this whitey cream colour as well. And then the next one is just all different flowers, which I've got from all sorts of places. In there. Okay, so the next set here is when the top is some wooden items for decoupage, so boxes and hangers. The next one down has got a variety of candles which I'm going to decorate up um, using napkins and tissue paper. Then the next drawer down is some of my candle making stuff, so different um, fragrances in there, um, some dried flowers and um, some moulds. And then in the last drawer is where I keep my soaps and my candles again for decorating. And all these drawers are on wheels, or the front ones, so they can be easily pulled out. I pull them out that one. Behind there I have a new drawer. And if you see on the shelves there, they're just some glass jars. I've bought from Upcoming Wedding, which I'm going to decorate and then put to see those um, flowers. That's which are flowers they're going to go into those. So, in this one, in the first one is where I keep the decoupage papers and napkins. See, that's a pretty napkin there, and some more there. Then, decoupage papers. And then again, the next drawer is just full of wooden items for decoupaging and then some hangers and more sort of wooden boxes. So then pull that one out. Behind here, these boxes all contain my material. So in this first one, this is all the pattern cotton, so my cotton prints. Show you some of the ones I've got. First top year all Paris related. I love these vintage style ones. These are my favourite ones. More sort of vintagey. Okay, so with all those ones. And then there's some more cotton prints in there. Then I've just got plain cotton, cotton jersey and just um, some wool mixes. Then next one along I've got my scrap pieces, my old ganza and then I've got some fusible web and stabilizers, some wadding in that one and in my bottom one I've actually got some of the soaps and candles which I've made. So these are packaged up. So, some pretty ones there. Some decorative candles.
there. Um, then come to the next set of drawers. So I've got all my silks, more silk, poly prints, tully, net, and other stuff. Next one is the lace, and then any of the fabrics go in the bottom one. So I'll come back up here, and these ones actually pull out as well behind here and have more stuff. I'm not going to pull that one out because it's going to knock the glass jars off. Okay, but in most of those it's just um, different embellishments, so lace pieces, and um, that one's got yarn, felt, that one's got cotton, canvas and jute bags. Um, next one up has just got some um, um, rhinestone set. So the next one up from that has got all my screen printing stuff and then next one up from that has got all my florist ribbon for making um, um, pretty things for my um, gift parcels. And then the next one along, the top one has got all my handmade cards and gift bags. And the next one down from that is all my silverware accessories. And then the next one down has got my card punches and embossing plates. Next one, my ink pads and embossing powder. All my different stamps are in that one. That one, all my ribbons are in there. And all my different adhesives are in that one. And if I just pull these out, I can show you what's behind the next one. These drawers are actually £15 each. I got most of them from b and Bargains. Um, yeah, so they were £15 each, or you could get two for £25, which makes a really good deal. Some of them originally were grey and I actually spray painted them red. Um, so yeah, behind here you can see I've got um, pre-folded cards and envelopes. This has got all my different coloured cards. Um, the next one down is all my pattern paper, 12 by 12s. And then the next one down has got some more 12 by 12 cards and some 6 by 6s as well. Also some glitter paper. And the last one just has um, photo paper and um, laminating pouches. So come back up and we'll just push that one back in. It's back in there. So if we come back up to the top of this one. We have um, all my mask making stuff in there for making masquerade mats. Um, just some tools. This one has my soldering irons in. I've got a couple of soldering irons in there. All my metal stamping tools. So I've got metal stamps, little metal pieces, um, hammers, stuff like that. So it's got all my different resins in and um, silicon putty for making moulds. Next one down has got all the moulds in that I've made so far. And then again, if we pull this one out, I'll show you what's behind. So in here's all my different polymer clays and all the accessories. All my different watercolours and acrylic paints. And then there are all my artist pencils and oil pastels. And the last ones have just got some wiring. Okay, so next we come over to my desk and we're going to start down at the bottom. So at the bottom here, I've got my guillotine and underneath the guillotine is my edible printer which I use for printing onto icing sheets and for putting onto cakes. And then just above that, on this shelf here, I've got my Silhouette Cameo. Um, I use that for my card making, to cut out little um, things for putting onto cards. It's a little card top and stuff. And then if we come up to the top of the desk here, oh, just going out of focus a little bit. First thing you see here is my little Minnie Mouse alarm clock. And I've got my little carousel here, which spins. It's 
got different things in scissors, paint brushes, some glue, cell tape in there, some jewelry tools, some X Acto knives, and then I've got my little red lamp, and then my little mini mouse sits there on top of the speakers. Put my little chicken egg timer. Um, I use that when I put my dinner on downstairs in the oven and I come up here doing crafts I put that on so I don't burn my own dinner and then um, just here is my little red weighing scales which I use for weighing my parcels before I post them and then if we come up to the wall just above the desk here this is my character chore of me which was done at a recent wedding fair I think it's quite a good likeness <laughs> so yeah I really like that one and next to that is my memory board this has just got some photos from different photo booths that I've got from different wedding fairs and then there's just some of me and my friends at different events and then come back down here I've got my computer it's a touch screen one but I've never bothered with the touch screen um, this is just my drawing tablet there and then under that shelf is just some document box it was just some documents in there this on my desk is actually my wedding planner, so I'm currently planning my wedding. Um, I made this last week. Um, I'm thinking of doing a tutorial on how to make it. It was originally just a um, folder this colour, and these were just different coloured um, dividers which I've painted. So yeah, I'm thinking of doing a tutorial. So keep an eye out for that and then here again this is my little wedding notebook wedding planner it's got all my wedding information in that just done um, untie that I can show you inside yep so and here's all the information for my wedding and then all my little dividers I've painted and decoupage this pattern onto it. So yeah, I'm thinking of doing a um, tutorial for that as well. So yeah, keep a look out for that one if you're interested. And then I'll just move down to the next one. So, and this is looking a bit messy, I'm hoping to recover this. And um, my keyboard's there. And my mouse and then under here it's a bit dark just brighten it up this is my a3 photo printer we also use it for printing onto canvas and then um, I use the canvas that I printed on to make like purses and stuff with my own little design on and then underneath is just some more storage boxes and just there is my laminator so then I'll come back up so yeah, next to my memory board I have this one's my masquerade mask and that one is my fiance's masquerade mask. We got those when we were in Rome. And then I've got my white metal dress form with some masquerade magnets on there and my black dress form, metal dress form there. And then next to that is my, it's another cutting pot, a bit like a silhouette but um, not as advanced but it can cut up to a free size and then this is just my camera and then if we come down again these are my trimmers there I've got an a free size one and a four one and then in this drawer I've just got all my different pens in there and then in this drawer I've got my um, binder and all my A3 art pads and A3 cards stuck in there as well. So if we just come back up, I'll just give you an overview of my desk there. There you go. And then if you look at my desk chair, I've got a little um, Minnie Mouse bow cushion on there as well. 
Okay, so next part of my room is here. This is my shelves, and on these you can see I've got all my Me Too teddies. Next shelf down is just some documents, boxes. This here is my A4 photo printer, and next to that is my mini oven, which I use for baking my polymer clay. And then if you come down here, you can see I've got a microwave. So if you look closely, you can see I've got my microwave kiln in there, and that's for making my fused glass jewelry. And then next to that is all the accessories needed for making fused glass. So all my different glass pieces. Yep, so all my different glass pieces in that this one has actually got my um, glass decals so I use this for putting like patterns onto the glass and then these are all the glass making tools and these are all the larger pieces of glass in there and then next shelf down I have my laser printer this is what I use when I want to put um, toner foil onto any cards or invitations that I'm making so I have to use that one and then I've just got a lot of storage boxes down there um, that is my shredder and that is my kickstool because I'm too short to reach most stuff in here um, the next thing I've got here is my dress form and she's got some mini masses on her there and then just have like a hanger for decoration there and a canvas of buttons and then on the walls, I've just got some ribbon holders there. And these little drawers hold um, pins and other um, dressmaking things. So needles, machine needles, bobbins, measuring tapes, stuff like that. Then under here, this drawer here, it's got all my different sewing machine feet in there. This one has all my embroidery threads. This one, just normal thread, and then all these different ones are different coloured thread. This here is actually my grandma's sewing machine, so I just keep that for sentiment to value. And then if we come up to the top again. On this top shelf is just some decorative items, so bird cages and some um, candle holders. Again, next one down has just got some decorated items, some um, glass jars and just some drawers. Next shelf down and we've just got a magazine holder but that's in there has got all my dressmaking and sewing books. And then the one over here, again, dressmaking and sewing books. I've also got a picture of me and my fiancé and then just some scissors, measuring tape buttons and then next one down so I keep all my sewing machines this one here is my embroidery machine that one's a brother machine all my other machines that I've got are all genome so this one is my embellishing machine this one is my sewing machine and that one is my overlocker so then if we come down to this drawer here you can see this is where I keep all my different buttons and just other embellishments there and then in this drawer is where I keep all the pedals for all my machines and all my embroidery machine accessories all my scissors and or I don't know if you can see there but I've also got the design plus for the brother so I can design my own embroidery things so if we come back up go back onto the wall I have more ribbon holders there and underneath that I've got a mini dress form and in these you can see that's where I store all my seed beads So next on my desk here I've got all my jewellery findings, they're in both of those set of drawers and I've got, I've got a clock just above there 
These are all um, edible sprinkles and I put those into some of my resin jewellery. Next over, on the top there I've got my 30th birthday plaque which all my friends signed for me. And then just more jewellery findings in there. And same in here, there's just all different random things. Powers in most of these. So you have these different And then under there I've got different beads. These are mostly letter beads at the front here. And under here is just different coloured beads. That's just an idea for one of the, for a wedding invitation. And this was the invitations which are made for my engagement party. And then under here Actually here we've just got some boxes, this one is for decorating, but this one here, just all my scraps from when I've been doing my decoupaging, decoupaging, and here is all my, um, well not all, but some of my ribbon bows. And then underneath here I have another box, and in this box is lots of different buttons. And if you can see there, there's lots of little wooden boxes there for decorating, for decorating up. And then to move along with her, I've got um, lots of different pearl beads. And if we move across, you see I've got lots more there in those storage boxes. And in that one, I've just got different charms there are some larger ones goes there and then if we come back up I've got other bits and bobs there top of there I've got a love sign and then in these it's just more cameos and then if we come down here these are all the smaller cameos all my ribbon bows and um different charms. This is a little um, little penguin that my brother got me for Christmas and this is my money box and then down here is all different craft books and then a little lamp. And if you actually look on my desk I've got some stuff that I've been working on. This is a Mr and Mrs sign for my wedding and then these are just some hangers I've been working on for the bridal party okay so if we now come underneath the desk under here I've just got all my different marker pens in there then this has got all my different toner foils then the others have just got different papers, the bottom one's got tissue paper in it. The next set has like my business cards and um, envelopes. This next set of drawers, top one's got feathers, this one's got zips, that one's got all my fabric paint and um, fabric sort of stamps. Um, the next one down I think has got my porcelain paint, the last one's got my glass paint. Um, behind there there's just all my scraps of fabric. This is my freezer paper. And then these drawers just have different things in. Most of it's got all my handmade jewellery in. This one's got rings in. That one's got more rings. More rings. Most of these are actually rings down here. Actually, I think they're all rings in there. So if we then come over here here so this part this one's got all my handmade cameos in some of them haven't been painted yet some more cameos in there this has got some resin pieces in so just different pieces in there in here's just where I keep all my CDs okay so 
if we come back up up here I've got another memory board there's not anything on that one this here is a fan that I got from Barcelona and underneath there is my A3 printer it's also an A3 scanner and an A3 fax machine and then in the cupboard down there is just where I keep all my ink cartridges for the printer and then next to that is where I keep all my different handmade jewellery so in this one is the pink pearl and, um, earrings and these are just some cameo charms cameos so I think that is everything okay so I think that is everything so I will just give you an overview of the room 